right, guys, but we're a couple minutes out right now. We have the peanut gallery ready to go. Chris and Nathan all excited to do the unboxing. So let's get into it as these bowls are being packed and coals being lit. Okay. There you go, that's the best, like, ultimate creeper status. <laughs> And then my camera won't change. This should be me. Where did my hose go? <laughs> so everybody say hi. Hi. Hey. Hello. Hi. Hey. Hey. We might need, even though you're short, you might need to sit. Yeah, I know. I'm kidding. <laughs> <laughs> All right, guys. Here we go. Changing the direction. Sorry for those who are viewing. I can't turn my phone while live. Okay. You need to get on me. Come on. Yeah, I was trying to like keep the box in the uh, pack here. Here, I'll give you the scissors. Oh, that works. You can get my hand on Okay, I was like, I have a pocket knife. Alright. So. I'll just follow for a little different than we of course. Oh man, you go deep in there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, you got all the pieces and everything. Now you have to give it's everybody like proper instructions. Yeah. <laughs> Someone's gonna mess it up if they don't have it, right? Yeah. That's so cool. You explain everything. Plus the directions give you yeah. the optimal way to use the piece regardless. So any questions that pop up, do you guys want me to ask? Yeah, I mean, cool, cool. the guy right here. Cool, cool. So guys, any questions you have or anything you see that sounds interesting, let us know and we will have him ask. Would someone be able to finish with the plan over there or neglect it to complete it? Do you know? Sorry, we kind of rushed you. I'm bad. Sorry. <laughs> Terrible. So I just want to put that out. Guys, I don't want to hold them up. Yeah. Oh my god. That's it, right? That's it. That's it. Megan, why don't you have dimmers? Look at this guy. Turn it off. I'm kidding. I'm going to use this as its own fucking placemat view. Actually, yeah, there's another one in there, too. That you can actually use. Holes in it. Really? Yep. That's oh, the bottom, bottom piece? Yep. Like if you put it in a car or something like that. You know, we've already been having that. <laughs> we've already been cooking the brain. What's going on, Tanner? How are you, sir? What's up, Travis? <laughs> Flip the camera. Why am I flipping? You want me to go like this? But then you don't get all the beautiful people. Yeah. Oh, are you doing straight from Actually, um, is it provost? Yeah. Is this better, Travis? I didn't notice this before. This design. Oh yeah, that's the machine works. Oh. So you know it's good. <laughs> <laughs> but not these guys. I didn't notice this either before. Is this new? No, that's that's, that's always been there. Yep. Yeah. Wayne wants to borrow it. Yeah. Wayne can. Come to Vegas. Yeah. What I would do is loosen that nut so that you can just take the top neck off. Yep. And it'll slide right off. It keeps everything else down in there. Oh, gotcha. Yeah. Yeah, that should be good. Oh. Yeah. There we go. I actually want to get this oh, light. Yeah. So, any questions that people have? I'm sorry, Travis. I don't do lives via the phone. <laughs> I am super excited. So I'm just concentrating on this right now and nothing else. Like, it could be a fire. Come on, man. Do you have a bowl pack for this one? Or are you smoking this, it? For this one, yeah. I have a bowl pack already. Okay. I just don't have holes for it. Or water. Yeah, it might be coals, extra coals yeah. on there. No coals? You want to one? I'm gonna get a close up of that HU. Yeah. yeah that's new. That's Look at that. We saw that the other day, guys. He was going at it. Yeah, that's Travis' creation. Beautifully done. Yeah, I saw when Travis made the art for it. So it's not even one. Did he send it to you guys? Yeah. Yeah, he can show us all the time. What? Hold you up. Uh, is it four or how many? Oh, just yeah, four, four, please. Thank you. That's cool. You know what I do need? Water. We, 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 it's behind you. We already have it. 
so it technically that's no, cool how, like this piece comes off from that yeah yep if you want to clean it it's for cleaning a lot of people just leave it in there you know they were 50 to 60 percent 50 percent is a good Water, There's another glass. Have we got more, more than that? Oh. Wow, we have cups of water for days. It's great. It's the desert. What do you expect? It's the only thing we have a plenty of. Water and heat. Boom. Is that good? Is that good? Uh, okay. so you were asking about what caused it up a little bit to spread the light. Yeah, so if we're looking, talking diffusion, right? Like the smoke is naturally diffusing the light because it has that property. You said ice. Have you tried any other liquid? I know I'm not saying we put liquids in bases, guys, but if for anyone that does put liquids in bases. You could or ice. Now, would the, the cassette diffuser have any negative impact with that? Because I know I still know people that put milk in the base, no matter what I tell them. I don't recommend milk because my understanding is the proteins tend to stick a little bit to the mm -hmm. plastics, glass, plastics, and that all. That's you know, the same thing. Once you screw it down, I'll tighten also. Yeah, I was like, I think we'll do it. What I do is I do this one and this one, just you can tighten it, and yeah. then yeah, do the uh, Jason. Does anyone in the peanut gallery have questions, Megan? Sharice. Yeah. The, the, the question's going to be like, when can I get mine? Well, I mean, yeah, that is yeah. definitely my question. I want one. It's a good question. What's going on, Stefan? How are you, bud? I can't wait to get mine. Uh, my question is, when can I get that hose in a minute? That's my question. <laughs> I'm excited, man. You guys nearly have your lights synced together, by the way. There is a fade. I like fade, like yeah, it so much better. I do appreciate the fact that you include the light. Thank you. I think that's something not a lot of. And the grommets. Yeah. For a lot of us, we fucking run out of grommets. Like fucking. Then you get three different size grommets. This fits just about everything, but you know you get the difference. The fact grommets. that you have the thickest mod grommet. Yeah. Which are super hard to find in the first place. <laughs> right. Yeah, they're small, medium, and large. And you can trade them between your part here. So Travis wants to know when his ship's out. <laughs> he knows he has it. Oh, he yeah. just wants oh, to know Monday. when. Monday. All right. Yeah, it's in the box ready to go. Wayne, we, we just addressed this. We don't know when you're getting yours. Because you're definitely not getting Chris's. No, no one's getting mine. <laughs> so you've got the, the Hooper University logo on this one. Do you plan on doing any other designs like that? Uh, it was uh, something I did just as a thank you. Show the love to H.U. But mm -hmm. um, I'm open. So if you want to come in and do something like that, you know, we'll do designs and and stuff. It's something I definitely have the capability of. Yeah, well, so like if somebody wanted to put in a custom order and they gave you a design to go with it, you might be willing to do that. Mm -hmm. Are you able to do that? Yep. As long as yep. no I just did that for uh, cards. Car and yeah, because I'll talk to you about mine then. He's got a big fat lion pen on one it, uh, on like 6 o'clock and 12 o'clock. Yeah. And he's got HU. How great is cards? He's cool. cool. <laughs> 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 so yeah, he's super fucking What's going on, David? He's got a lot of fucking stories. <laughs> uh, Nicole, you can have it set on color changing and fade. So we have actually the one on the left here is fading and standard LED proceed things you can speed it up to, right? You can do speed, you can do light, heavy, you know, like a bright. You have a grommet for it? Back here, I'll go I have a grommet. Thank you. Uh, cars, he actually, we just talked about you, bro. His is, uh, yours is in the works, too. There's dim. Do you want to go dim? Or do you want to go bright? You can really turn it on. Like, if you dim the lights, you, you, these things will really glow, but... And it goes right through the light. Is there enough background light that we can see behind? One thing I've noticed to behind what? Like, if we hit this light off, would we be able to see you guys still? And it really makes it... Yeah, no. I think it's one of these. Yeah. When David would have his. Alright, we're going to play with the white light switches, guys. Not that one. That one. Hey. Can you still pick up my video in the way? Oh yeah, you guys are fine. Why is this saying lag but it's so far behind? Because there's a lag. Every live stream has a lag. So, so what I'd like to do is just tighten it to me a sweet spot. Can uh is that a manual, David? Yes, that is a manual. The coals can be placed on top. Uh we actually talked about this earlier. Nathan explained yeah. to me the difference between plexi and the top. This is this is glass. This is 1200 degree glass. It's the highest temperature glass you can buy, known to mankind. It's the same glass that is used in re-entry vehicles. So you can sit 
six coals on here, or whatever, and it's not going to break. If you splashed water on it, it's not going to crack. Okay. Chris, why did you shave your beard? What? I shaved my beard? Yep. Oh, According to Stefan, you shaved your beard. Stefan, are you drinking again? I've ever had a beer. I don't, I don't Stefan's drunk, clearly. Mm. Stefan, go. Mo Moise is here. What is that under Chris's hot box? So that's actually one, some of the padding. Uh, the padding is actually, it's not laser, it's not a laser etching, right? It's basically just oh, deep set foam. That? Or it's a pressure foam? Yeah, it's, it's our polyethylene packaging. But yeah. we have them all custom. Custom, uh, I hope you can see. You, you're good. I have perfect lighting. So you got a nice whisper quiet. Yeah, that's crazy. Yeah. So you can show like the differences yeah. between. Sharice, what are you smoking? I'm smoking cane mint by Tangiers. <laughs> five <laughs> five francs out of five. <laughs> Is it just one bowl there, Anita? Yes, one. Yeah. Yes, I'm winning. Athena, really? I don't know. <laughs> You're, you're smoking K Peach Cane. Or actually, you're ex uh, not K Peach Cane. Foreplay, oh, dirty. Much better. Better. Much better. Yeah, this, this is a beautiful look. Thank you. Thank you. It's pretty cool. Yeah. Like, I like the whole like metal. Yeah. It's called the Scorpion House. Does anyone still make them? Um, I don't know. I got it at. It's a hair smoke, huh? When. Good. HQ, I think. Danielle has one. Also, I'm gonna rip this. I got a hookah. We're good. What are you smoking? Peppermint? Milkshake? PMS? Cool. Yeah, we're having a little PMS. No. No, that's my hose. No hose, no bowling. Um. Okay. So standard hose port adaptions, probably. Yep. Okay. Let's get a. Let's look at that purge. Do you want to show the other oh, style purge like too? That. Oh yeah, you want to see uh, what we call a macro purge? Travis it's a little early for it, but I'll show you the concept. So this is a regular purge. I'm watching it. Right. You can do it with two breaths. You can evacuate the entire thing. Oh, Travis, macro oh, purge means you can loosen the lock ring, okay. pull the diffuser above the water level, and you blow through the hose and it will go through the downstem bowl and up through here to cool an older uh, an older uh, bowl. So just blow kind of gently. And if you drop it below the water level, it's automatic. This will automatically turn on so you don't blow water up there. So I'll just drop it and you'll see this turn on. That is so cool. Yeah. And then so this also features uh, a backdraft purge. So every time you, you do your inhale, the cassette diffuser inside, which is a horizontal diffuser, claps shut through a water implosion and it blows like a small cursory draft of air through here as a bowl of maintenance. Mm -hmm. So as soon as I inhale, you'll see the, the smoke come up. So yep. that, it's just a light, a light poof to keep things. Now was that, was that something to, to, in the design process that you anticipated or is that something that ended up being kind of a coincidence that benefited the project? It's all purpose built. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Um, I like how like because of this is like what like this like plexi or like glass yeah. type thing that the light I don't know if you can see if you can bring it closer. But oh, like we've got yeah, you're good. Like just shines through here as well, so it also looks like this is constantly illuminated. Yeah, that's a light light. I right, that that looks pretty. Yeah. That's pretty yeah, dope, that's, man. That's pretty like, good. There's no color here, and then it's just right up here, like shining through almost. Well, that's just because the crystalline structure of the plastic it's is diffusing it vertically, right? Yeah. It's gonna be perfect in Vegas too, because if you think of Vegas, you think of the lights and how they do that. It's very, there. it's very Tronish up top. <laughs> right? Yeah. It's a good yeah. <laughs> Don't, sh guys, guys, Paul's watching. Shh. He wants his tesseract. That's he all he keeps saying. That's all he keeps saying. The tesseract hookah, man. That. But I think you got number eight of ten. That's it. That's an improved. I barely made it, guys. I just did it. <laughs> Woo! Are there any more? Uh, not for beta. Re this beta release. So we're. Is that what seven? Nathan, you got told you look younger. Car, Car says you look much younger. You do look oh. younger than your profile picture. I don't know. Oh, he yeah. looked. You looked. You looked like you just turned twenty-one in that picture of you at Top Golf. Do you guys know how old I am? Not, I don't play that game. <laughs> <laughs> I don't get offended. Now I want to know. Yeah, okay, give me, give me your best guess. 36. Nothing's going to fit. 
<laughs> 94. <laughs> <laughs> 33. Okay. I was going to say 34. 34? Okay. I got 32. 32. All right. okay, well, I'm going to go high end. 38. 38. I like those numbers. I'll be 40 this year. <laughs> and not only does he make a so guys, hookah, this, he found the fountain of youth. So let's also yeah. prove a point here that hookah is not for young people all the time. <laughs> right. I didn't want to spoil it. <laughs> How old does Steve Marshall look? <laughs> Before <laughs> and yeah. after. You went straight to 80. <laughs> you had a hard life. <laughs> went from your friendly neighbor to your dad. Um, well, that works because apparently Facebook automatically tagged you when I put you on camera. Yeah. That's creepy. The future! Yay. <laughs> future! Just learn a whole painting watch. Look at oh my this God. In it, it tagged Fletcher in one of the posts, and Fletcher wasn't even, the guy looked nothing like Fletcher. It tagged Zach Palmer for a guy that had hair. That so, diffusion at that level we talked, because that's, that's full depth. That's full depth. Okay. Wall. You're underwater by darn near four inches. So, displacement, right? What's that? You're, you're, you're recommending putting it about 50, 60 percent full. 50 to 60 percent. Be, and that's probably because there's, you, you have a, too. you can go higher, I'm sure, but <laughs> displacement and the fact that, I know, I don't know how much the cassette weighs by itself, but the displacement effect on the water isn't severe no, in any way. it's feather light when it's introduced yeah. into water. I mean, it's super light. It's, I, yeah. Most weight is the water that's in it. That's how I, yeah. So if you inhaled, you wouldn't need to, but I don't know, for the sake of discussion, you can inhale while you're pulling it. Well, it looks dope. Me. Yes. Aside from your throat is now well, in severe pain. Don't die, man. <clears throat> but yeah, it's super. What is Chris's first smoke? What did you have? PMS. Oh my god. That's why you gotta carry it with tongs, man. Yeah, no. It's making me So. You can lock it in place completely as well with that threaded, right? Any high you want. So is there, there's breakdown to it. It's got to, I mean, I'm sure it's, I'll ask off camera. I'm excited. <laughs> Dan, are we talking about the mouthpieces we have? I haven't mentioned them. You can, you can do what you like, sir. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to set this call. I, don't know I am, I am not making this about anything like that. I was trying to make it Nathan's. Well, I was just saying, since we're showing off cool products here, I'm just going to say. All right. So back to Stephen Marshall. <laughs> <laughs> I actually want to take a rip on of this. You take the camera. Here, I'll switch your spots. I'm taking the hose there. There's Megan. You'll see the difference in the draw. Full depth gets you a tighter draw, lighter. Lift, you lift it up and you get a loose. There's Athena. Try to adjust this. Hiding over there. So even. Let me start at the bottom. It's not that it was hot. I'm trying to figure out how oh. much force I need to apply. Just make sure that's loose because there's a, a lock inside that okay. it. <clears throat> so it, it basically self-tightens after a drop. That's really cool. I liked how when you dropped it, even with the weight of the bowl and everything else, it didn't slam. Right. Yeah. Like, well, I, honestly, well. I was nervous when you first dropped it because I was like, oh my goodness. Yeah. But that water... So if, if, I didn't, if I hadn't seen that already, I would have let you know. Usually, that's why find I, it's like I sort of like my table. Want, yeah. You know, what you can do too is you can also tighten it. Just do a moderate. Athena. Tightening. So you can hold it. Travis Leader says hi again, friend. Hi again, friend. Okay. And you can also push it down and it'll stay. Like, this one is like this. So, so you got Sup, Travis Green. So what's kind of amazing? That is mean. crazy, dude. Like yeah. you could just play with it. Well, yeah, you find the one the setting. You yeah. Use. So you, that's the one thing I've liked about it is. So, at least depending on when I would first start smoking it, it was nice to have it like at a look deeper setting. And then as I keep smoking the bowl, like that, that or like at the fresh start of the bowl, I'll have it higher. Yeah. That way I get the fresh flavor. And as it goes down, like as it ages, I lower it and it keeps the bowl fresher. That's exactly it. So if you, if you get like, so you're starting to taste some nasty flavor, you can drop it a little deeper and then that's going to delete. A lot of those offensive flavors, but just because yeah. it's an older bowl. But the fact that you can go and put a lot of heat on the bowl and just have it at the lowest setting and it doesn't taste like it's going to kill you. Right, right. I mean, so, we've tried this where you've had the bowls last 
for over four hours and then it doesn't taste like death. Yeah. Witchcraft! <laughs> I don't understand, like... We've, we've had a lot of witchcraft. No, we're not in Tucson, David. <laughs> this is like, I'm messing with it here, it's just slight changes. So, one thing I do like about the draw is it's like, we leveled, we leveled it up a little bit and I still hit the same. Water restriction normally has an issue where the, if you don't like your draw, throw <coughs> some water in. And this is something where it's even now... You feel that rumble, but it still gives way. And yeah, it's, it's not It's really light. light. It's it's not it's not like I'm trying to sort of like yeah. I'm not vacuuming my lungs out. That's right. You know, like it, and it doesn't nice it doesn't change the restriction too yeah. much. Like you notice it, but it's not a bad notice. This was designed so that there's no restriction in the unit as much as whatever you control. So if you put on like a different bowl or you put on a different hose then this is not going to be the common denominator to yeah. screw up your session. I want to know what people are looking forward to when they get their hands on it. Stefan, it has a built-in diffuser. I'm just playing with this thing. Like, so it has a cassette diffuser. So. That's one of the things I like about the match. Yeah. Here, you Chris, you want to take a hit? It it doesn't get well, this is like, this is right at the, like, right at the top. Yeah, so I've done one special. Yeah, you might want to put it down just. Because it's good to break into the fiber to break that channel. Yeah, here, David, fiber. you want to take a hit? Or Nathan? So you can see there, there's how the diffuser is. So it's a cassette diffuser, and it really works very well. It's a cassette. You know, a little cassette in French means small box. Yeah. It doesn't mean tape player, or you know, <laughs> you put a tape player. Yeah. So it has like how many holes? It's like six, 65 holes all around. So it has the bubble scrubbing. It like does all kinds of things, and it works really well. It's an old bowl diffuser. Ah, oh, Frank See, Simmons here. It's so quiet, you hear it going through here before you. <laughs> yeah, it's. What's up, it's, Frankie? So you take a pull of yours. <sighs> I just hear this. I yeah, it sounds like a turbo. Yeah, you yeah, can't. Cool you can't even hear them. So I hear Sharice's more than I hear it's the hot boxes. How do you block this? How do you lock it? Well, so you, you bring it closer. I don't know which one of you wants it. Uh, so it has a, that's a tension lock. So right there where he's uh, screwing in, that's so how you lock it and unlock it, Travis Green. Um, so when you un 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 unlock it, you can raise it and lower it, and then once you find the spot, you just tighten it and it'll hold it in place. Exactly. So it doesn't, it doesn't take much. No. Um, although I would say, for people who are have one at least now. Um, I don't. This is why we don't have Yeah. Um, so a question for you, Nathan, then, yeah. is it, are you looking at something, because like how you have the coal on yours right now, when, the, how hot does the lock mechanism get? Like, are oh, you, you just don't touch it. okay. It's, it's actually, mine is coal. Because yeah, but this he has the, deck, this, oh, he's talking about like with, with the, the coal. Like, yeah, like if you have multiple coals no, and stuff. That's a great question because this, this is what we call the top deck, this entire assembly, and it operates as a heat sink. So it absorbs enough heat, more heat than what the coals can put out. So by the time it reaches this, you yeah, because I mean, at least from my perspective, like especially if you're gonna have these in like a lounge setting, yeah, the biggest thing would be safety then, because you don't want customers or people getting burned, and oh, for sure. if you know, it, you don't want it to come back, like if people were to go and get burned and then be like, oh well, I got burned because of the hot box, right. like so I know people would have questions like that. Yep. User error always um, playing with fire. <laughs> yeah. so Chris, just, just be smart. They're hot coals, guys. Uh, Chris, so Stefan is asking, can we win one on the frat at the uh, the day at the frat house? We are confer not confirming or denying anything. All right. Is it possible to kill the fan? Let's see if I can blow, you can blow small drains out of this. Um, Wayne, right now uh, these are just in beta, so. Once they're available for purchase, I'm sure Nathan and others will be uh, making a post saying that they are available. But right now they are only in beta and they only had a limited amount. And then uh, another question to Nathan, whether or not you're going to make a matching hose handle. I'm not in the hose handle business right now. I feel like a lot of guys have zero data and do a pretty damn good job. But 
I'm, I'm open. You know, but right now, no. Uh, Frank says Hotbox gets five francs out of five. I love it. Travis Green says Chris is so sexy. Travis, oh, I hope you're drinking. Mr. Green, we always drink on our interactions. <laughs> <laughs> this is very, it's very impressive. Obviously, the box hooker is nothing new. I know a lot of people have seen it around, but bringing like this type of engin ingenuity. Is sure, that yeah. Can I make that word up? Yeah. No, no, that's it. No, ingenuity is a word. Ingenuity. Uh, I like the purge. I like the fact that you can change it no matter what. No one's gonna be like, oh, that's an open or that's a restricted pipe. It can be whatever you want it to be, based on how you preference. And even like, say, say like he likes a more restricted draw, right? And I like open draw, so I'll take a pull. Uh, pass off to him. And if he likes something a little different. Right? Just drop. We could just drop it down depending on your smoking preferences. And now, like say I gotta go do something and he likes a, a certain type of draw, I can go do something else. And now he has the way he likes to smoke and we're both smoking the same flavor. This is also good for you wanting to, when you preheat a bowl, just letting your bowl sit and cook. You have to go away for a minute. This drops the height because you're not going to have that heat quite effect. You're having a higher depth of water actually absorbing more of that heat out of the smoke. Okay, let's just be honest here. This is perfect for when you're smoking tangiers because everyone knows about the tangier shits. So you go, you take, you, you, you take your first few hits, you get that shit feeling because it's tangiers. You go, you take your shit, and you leave your bowl of coals on it, and by the time you come back, it's going to be fine. So this is perfect for that. Or you do the macro purge. Oh yeah, or the macro page. You do it on this one. So pull it up above the water, and it'll go right out in the bowl, and it'll cool the bowl like it's been sitting, because you don't want to leave it off the coal, right? Uh, Stefan is asking how much they are going to go for. The betas were released at two eighty nine, but that was an intro price or beta price, so that's to be determined. So TBD, Stefan. I'm still trying to get. Uh, I still think for Stefan though. Has a discount code somewhere. Yeah, for Stefan, I, I think you know, a million dollars. You know. <laughs> I I, I we'll want to you know, I will tell you this. I have okay. I have like smokes. I have Matt Paris. I have freaking uh, El Nefes. I have traditional pipes. I have modern pipes. Um, I even have a um, what is it? Uh, shisha box hookah at home, right? I, I have a lot of different pipes, and to see something like this that is pure utility and it performs and it's made very well. And it looks good too. It has a lot of functionality to it, which is pretty cool. And I know a lot of people out there want something that works very well, want something that can they can travel. Especially I know people at Hooker University, you know, we like to go different places, and it's hard to bring like the yeah, Aljamal or so, like a really super expensive pipe that you like smoking out of that certain way. Um, that oh they are synced up now, <laughs> but I mean this 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 like when you're looking for a hookah, this thing hits on so many like, different check boxes, and it's impressive and I like it. Um, that's why I had to jump on immediately. Yeah. After smoking it uh, in Florida with Jeremy Bird, I thought it was so cool. So then here's a question then for you, Nathan, because mm -hmm. um, I know people are going to be curious about cleaning it. How how would you say for cleaning the hot box? How easy is it? Like, is there any extra special work you need to do? Like, just like you're cleaning your salad bowl or your dishes. If you don't eat salad bowl, whatever you clean, you can. You don't eat salad. Yeah, you can do anything. But for those that toss their salad and smoke, <laughs> right. you could. Uh, you can just put this in. Uh, you know, so uh, like um, soapy water. Clean it. And what I recommend for cleaning the diffuser is you fill it with soapy water like this. And you just gently plunge it up and down and it does the same thing what a dishwasher does. It just flushes it out. Clean it, dry it, after you're done, and you're set. And then for the cause how the the host port, I don't know if anybody has noticed, the host port can pivot. I don't know if you wanna Yeah, but like you can do you can check on this one here and Yeah, because I mean you can see how well it swivels and it comes with uh what, food grade gun oil? No, it's a Japanese knife oil. Or Japanese knife oil, that's right. It's all, everything's food grade. So everything here is very good, no problems with rustings or anything like that. So I mean... So here's, here's a good question. 
inspiration. What, so what, what's your history with Luca? What got you into Luca? What led you to this point? <laughs> so, so many questions. That's an off loop right there. Um, I, I saw, so I'm a product developer and designer by trade. This is what I do. I've done this for years over multiple industries. I've been smoking hookah for a good part of over 15 years. <clears throat> I saw some of the other hookahs out there and I go, well, they haven't changed in hundreds of years for the most part, right? Other than aesthetics. Um, and they're all awesome. But I said, okay, let's do something different in the land of a thousand hookahs. How can I do something different that diffuses differently, gives better performance, gives adjustable performance, open and close draw, and you can do it on the fly as a user and not have to worry about do I have this hose or this bowl or whatever. And you can do it and it looks sexy. So this is the design I came up with and I like the performance. Yeah, like from what I've tested, it has been nothing but amazing. Um, I mean, and then Stefan says, tell Nathan I'll toss his salad. <laughs> Um, on the menu. <laughs> Travis Green has a so Travis Green has a question for you, Nathan. How well testing or how much testing has the swivel gone through? What's the potential of le it leaking air? Uh, it doesn't leak air. It's completely tight tight enough where it won't leak air. Like if I purge, you'll see. You can zoom into it. I'll purge, and you won't see any smoke coming out of it. And this is the one that you first made. That this one has been used. Uh, or these, that there's a few different ones, they've been used for over 18 months of testing. <clears throat> and these swivel ports don't have any leaking or anything. So there's a couple, I, I saw one on the Chinese market, more aluminum. Aluminum on aluminum sucks. It's basically like, I don't know, like a piece of chalk on a chalkboard that just grinds because aluminum is not designed to have metal on metal contact. Yeah. So this is a, a stainless steel alloy that's designed exactly to work like a bearing should to do hundreds of thousands of rotations without any type of curve. So it comes with the Japanese knife oil, I'm assuming it's just to keep the bearing itself. Yep. Oiled. Anytime you have moving parts, you want to take care of it. And the way I explain it to people is it's, if you had a $500 Gensu knife that's designed for cutting sushi and it's supposed to be sharp every time, you want to make sure to take care of it. So it's the same thing. So it's going to be a problem at the expo when we fight for it. Yep. Changing <laughs> color. <laughs> yeah, I was, I, I was looking at that like they see. I was in. Uh, hey, so Jeremy, what's your favorite color? That's too bad. <laughs> <laughs> um, so then a, a good question too would be, so say you ha uh, like say I have mine for example for two years and I end up running out of the knife oil, mm -hmm. would I have to go through you or is there one that no, you can use any food grade mineral oil. That's basically what it is. It's mineral oil. I don't recommend vegetable oil because it does a thing called polymerization, so not to get super scientific. If veggie oil is in contact with any metal, it's just it's a materials thing. It tends to coagulate and turn into a very gummy material. Like if you use olive oil, not a good idea. If you use uh, mineral oil, in this case Japanese knife oil, which is the same thing, it's just a food grade version of it, so you know it's safe. But it's safe on metals, it doesn't polymerize, it doesn't come up, and it stays clean. You don't want to use something like WD-40 or anything. And by oil, it, you only put like two, three drops on it after you're done cleaning it just to keep it so you take care of it. when you do that, you just apply the oil by moving it to the itself? Yep. Okay. Yeah. And it, it comes with a little dropper. I think, yes. There. Yeah, I'll bring it well, over. It's actually in the, in the package here. So, I mean, you get quite a good amount because you only need to apply, what, a few drops? Yep. Two drops, maybe three, four if you want to go crazy. Also comes with grommets, which are greatly appreciated. Yeah. Very inside the grommets. Um, tr so, Travis Green is asking, is there going to be replacement parts available for when it comes out to the market? Yeah, yeah, I, I do uh, keep them stocked and they're available. The, like, you're talking about, like, if you lose a part or, like, if a part breaks? I gotta wait for an answer at that uh, point. Well, maybe I was gonna say one of the cool things that a lot of these the viewers can't see. I mentioned it to Nathan when I first saw it. Is there's the the, the cabling that actually keeps yeah. these are they use a stainless steel cable that's plastic wrapped. So yeah, if you want to even just drop it, just so that yeah, and then you just put it back. Yeah, so if it drops, it hangs on there, so you won't lose yeah. the screws unless you and you can break. Take it away, yeah, in the corner if you want, or leave it out. So basically, 
very small to be. Oh my god, oh, you, <laughs> you would. I would. I that, actually. You would. You would put the hose in there? Yeah, you've got a narrow it. hose. It'll hook right in. There you go. You can. Or what I do is I just take the hose and you pinch it, and you can put it right there. Or you can put it whatever you want, like a bigger one like this. I just lay it on the deck. Just make sure you don't set it on top of the coal. Yeah. yeah I wouldn't put it on the coal, but. Yes. Did, was there ever a thought about making a choice in this, or you always thought, like, you know what, let's make it a little fun? I, I toyed with the idea, but this light pipe, you know, doesn't work if you put a metal tray and it kills the aesthetics. Mm -hmm. So, <clears throat> making this a 1200 degree glass uh, tray, it does everything. Now, if somebody doesn't like it, I mean, you can put a tray on it. I know Jeremy said he found a good tray that actually fits on it, because this comes off. And you can set a tray on top of the light pipe. Mm -hmm. And it'll be there, you know, and you might like it because then the light shines up on the tray, especially if it's like brass or, mm -hmm. you know, polished, whatever, it kind of looks cool, but stock, they come this way. Now, uh, I don't know if Jeremy's still in here, but Jeremy, can you, what's the diameter? Does the molecular catch, like, does it fit on there? See, that's what I actually asked him earlier about the... the uh, he is not in there. So, it's still worth, he'll go back to it, it's Jeremy. Yeah. So one of the things I asked is the, the molecular in the market for the German market, the molecular fits on everything. Yeah. And the, the thing is, the writing is almost universal. We, Nathan and I said, I said, it'd be a really cool idea. He said at the moment that it, it's a different proprietary threading. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But no promises, no words out of his mouth. I, I said, you know, he makes an adapter for this, this and when he goes international with it, He's going to have something where it fits automatically to the German market. So there, okay. So this is the first time I've actually said this publicly. There's actually I have a prototype uh, molasses killer that works with this. That's an in-house design, and it <clears throat> you can un you just gave everyone like a half a shot. <laughs> like everyone just <laughs> like what? Uh, excuse the men like, for a moment. Let's uh, just yeah. <laughs> yeah, we'll be right back. Yeah. So what you can do is it's a little box that's a replica of this or a cylinder. And it sits on top, so you can unscrew this and it screws on. And if you cover this, you can blow into this and it fills it with water. Just like from here, from the stem. It blows the water from here, fills the molasses killer up, you know, just this amount of water. And then you take your hand off the purge valve and then you can keep going. You're talking witchcraft shit right now. <laughs> I, you're blowing my mind. <laughs> Lucky we're not the same. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I, a, a lot of a lot of people keep saying tesseract, so that's why we're blue because people. Yeah, Paul, we did a breakdown technically earlier, so once uh we're done, you can rewatch it and it'll be there. Um, You're making me want to build like a shelf, like we were talking about it before, <laughs> like like a fucking stand. I'm gonna have to put this on behind me when I whenever I do stuff now. I think we need to make this. So in our Nathan, David's asking cool. if. Uh, <laughs> David's asking if he can share his cleaning picks. He doesn't know if there was something he doesn't want seen yet. Um, or he doesn't know if there's there any question behind it. He just wants to know if he could share his cleaning picks because he didn't know if there was something you didn't want oh, seen you mean yet. Like when he dismantled it. Yeah. Be sure. Yeah. So go ahead, David. Now I, I will say that I don't recommend. There's no need to take this light pipe sleeve off of. It's a down stainless steel, and it's sealed with O-rings so it doesn't get full of water or grime or anything. You can take it apart. I don't recommend it. Um, really, the best way to clean it is keep the cassette diffuser attached to the down stem and the bowl port, and then <clears throat> you would clean just like any other uka. You can run a brush through it, you can run water through it, you plunge it and clean it, you put it away. But if you really wanted to take it apart, you could. Uh, Travis Leader said, Nathan, just let go of the secret. Yeah, it comes with instructions. instructions. Read it. No, I want to see it. I'm going to go. Um, but otherwise, he says he. Travis Leader says he can't wait for it. It looks amazing. Paul says he wants his tesseract. <laughs> but we all know Paul's so needy. So Nathan, if, for those that are watching and those that have already, you know, they know about the product. Where can they find you? On Facebook, social media, etc. I know you don't have a timeline for full release or on your beta and everything like right. that, but what, what's your goal? In terms of release? In or? terms of release. What, what would, and it, it, there's no doubt about it that this is an amazing product. So the, the, it's, it's just a matter of time. That's how every amazing product is. Sure. Frank keeps telling me, 
I've seen this multiple times, Frank. I know, I'm a penis. Thanks. <laughs> this is like the third time you mentioned it. You said it like 15 minutes ago. I just got on the video and it was like, Chris, it, it, it's only because Frank wants it. Frank wants he it. Does. He, he does. He really does. I mean, he's a Chargers hey, Frank, fan. How's your fucking foot? Yeah, you. Uh, have you found any stairs recently? Yeah, be careful. We we sacrificed a pack of ten years in your in your name to the stairs. <laughs> Everywhere we go, we put a pack there just in case. Have you tried finding a different football team? <laughs> have you tried finding a better beer? Have you tried just taking like escalators? Are you staying at a hotel with an elevator this year? <laughs> are you gonna have like somebody carry you? Like are these, we? These are all valid questions. <laughs> So Cars is asking, does that mean Nathan's gonna make hookahs out of the other Infinity Stones? Hehe. <laughs> <laughs> well, I got all the colors. We got, we got yellow. <laughs> we got, we got blue. I don't need an, like an oval or the Infinity. Well, if you want the what is it, the Reality oh. Stone, you just gotta put red food dye in the water. <laughs> right. Yeah, that's it. Like that would work. Make a hose out of the staff. That would be cool. Fucking. Uh, thing. Stefan asks, is this going to be a batch release? For after the beta? For after the beta, Stefan, you got to be more specific. That That is possible. Right now, I'm waiting for the reception, more reception of the beta release. If people weigh in and they say, hey, I like this, I don't like that, or this is great, dude, don't fix it. Keep going with what you got. That's the kind of input I want. I want to pay respect to the industry. And so it, no, no, please don't make any more. This is good. I'm no, happy. I'm happy. I'm, 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 happy whoa, 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 I'm sorry. Whoa, whoa, whoa. No, I'm sorry. No, no, no. Shut your face. Okay, I wait, want one. Wait, 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 Arizona I want first. This, okay? If you don't make any more, Chris is getting mugged. <laughs> yeah. I mean, someone's stealing it. Oh, um, darn. I have to ship this to have you, guys right? heard of, Have you guys heard of the, brother, the Brotherhood of the Traveling Hot Box <laughs> Hookah? <laughs> it's real, bro. It's, so, uh, it's just the muggings keep happening city to city. So Frank said, I, walk, so up, yeah. I walk upstairs. Hot Box mugging this week. <laughs> so Frank oh, responded no. with, I walk upstairs every day and the Chargers might win a Super Bowl. One day, which we all know is false. One of, one of those, not even true. One of those things is a lie. Yeah, one of those things is a lie, Frank. Are we playing the whole which one's truth, which one's lie? <laughs> At this point, Frank, clearly you're just lying overall. You know, he didn't address the beer issue, so he knows. That's because he can't handle it. I, I still understand the shaving of the beard. I, don't I, don't understand understand that. That. I could see the hair. But not the beard. Uh, the hair, so maybe I want to know what your new thing's penis now. Is it because yeah, you shaved yeah. your head? I think so. Yeah, okay. Okay. I got to be curious about, you know, everyone's well, penis a lot of people The up. leprechaun next to Chris, Travis Green, is Megan. The leprechaun. The leprechaun. Sit here, the leprechaun. leprechaun. It's cool. We should have got She likes eyes. orange. Just call okay. her Okay, <laughs> you could see the regal is bigger than Megan. It's not bigger. It's half my height. Oh, my gosh. She has to go like this. Yeah, she has to look to see if the cold is still there. This is the box of perfect size for me then. Come on, Nathan. I mean, yeah, those are too high for her to, to reach. <laughs> How did this get too high for size? Well, if you want, I can take two down stems and thread them together. You know, so that's tough. That's <laughs> issue though, right? She's going to ask to get that tattoo on her side and show it to it. I would, oh. Hey, I'm, I'm already planning on talking to him. Don't worry. Uh, There's going to be a battle midget. <laughs> so the Frank best part about it is when she things it up a little bit, we can actually call All right, it. So two things. Frank says Bud Light ain't bad. Yes it is. <laughs> Travis <laughs> Leader's telling you it's you and me, Frank. Bud Light. Tiny terror. <laughs> yeah. And tiny terror, yes, yes, I know Travis, I'm a tiny terror. <laughs> Alright, any other questions guys? No, I think I think we went over a lot of things. We showcased the uh, boxing, we showed the different um what it can do. Uh, there's very little it can't do. I mean, in my we, have, we haven't addressed one thing though. What thing? I need your address. So publicly, we need your address. I, half these people in my freaking chat here have my address. That's, right. that's fine, so we know where to find you. Yes, yes. If you're gonna steal it from me, steal it on my home hey, I'm pretty sure I have to ship it. Don't worry, I'm pretty sure I have to ship it to him. So, so Nathan, oh, another <laughs> another question for Nathan is from Travis Green. Do you plan on making different sizes of the hot box? Not currently, but if somebody's got good input, I'm open. The only thing is if, if hot box talking, junior. If hot box you're talking junior. bigger. Yes, Travis said hot and box it's easy enough to Make do, it. but it's redesigning most of the parts to be bigger, like the glass and the top and bottom deck. If you did smaller, it'd be the same thing. So now the one thing that looked kind of cool, I did build one that had a four-inch tank base on it instead of a six-inch bottle. 
So it's it's really cool looking, but it wasn't something I released because you don't you just don't get the diversity of the water level and, and the up and down, the, the differential diffusion. So I'm open. So we made a 16 inch. Like a big yeah. tall one? Do you want a fish four? tank? What do you want? Like, right. tell him what yeah, you want. <laughs> no, no, no. This would be dope. With four different... All right, you combine four of them together with the top deck being one piece with four stems. Nathan, we have a cooler. Can easy. we make one out of a cooler? Like, what Okay, so no, like that, that, that would be like your expo <laughs> hookah where everyone's smoking out of one well, hookah, but it's... That's perfect for settings um, like this. Yeah. You just have it there. It's already a table. So we have another question from, you know, Frank okay, can't yeah, yeah. have a real team, Simmons, and can't apparently drink a real beer. Um, he is asking, is the glass shatterproof if it drops once you are safe? The, uh, the side is made of acrylic, so it's pretty safe. The top is made of glass. It is encased and insulated with a silicone, from grade silicone bond, ID silicone. But if you dropped it, it'd be like your cell phone. You don't want to drop it. It could break. It is really thick. It's 3 sixteenths. It's not made to be dropped. I mean, you never want to drop it, but... I think it's more of the question, say you're cleaning it and it's wet and it slips out of your hands and it falls onto the like tile or that. I'll put it this way, you have a way better chance with this thing together than you would if you dropped anything on a, a glass base. Okay. On your hookah. It's going to be a lot more resilient. I've dropped it before. The first thing that's going to hit the ground is going to be um, the aluminum. If you drop it like flat face down, you could hurt the glass, but it's pretty thick. So, the, so we do have... Yeah, it's, it's pretty Bless tough you. though. I've, I've beaten on the glass with a hammer before. I, I had a uh, like a unit that I made for breaking, basically. Yeah. And you, you know, you can bang on it. I don't we recommend it. We all stand next to each other before we get off live. <laughs> we all should just stand up. Me and Megan will just go like, wait, it's fine. Okay, Megan, stand up. I'll just up. stand there and slowly people can walk by. Look at, look at the hot box and be like... Hey. Just do like a lineup of shortest to tallest. Megan, we're going to make, make, make you a unit in measurement. Megan, the hot box, who can stand box. that at one eighth, Megan? <laughs> <laughs> See if you can, uh, this works. I'm one eighth you. <laughs> Yeah, go for it. Here, I'll get closer. See if I can get the out of the... See it? Oh, look at that. For those of you that can't blow O's. I can't. If you like disgusting. smoke tricks. The, the purge valve does do smoke tricks. The next one's gonna do tornadoes for you, too. Hell, the next one's gonna pack you a bowl. Yeah. This bowl is kicking my ass. Hey, I didn't want a curate for a bowl, that'd be fucking badass, okay? They make those, the shisha pods. Yeah, not those, that's fucking disgusting. <laughs> <laughs> we have to be more specific then. Alright, I think... I think it's time for the size... For you, gentlemen. Any other questions? I am, uh, I'm very happy. I, uh, this is probably gonna be my everyday food. Just because of everything I can do with it. Uh, very easy to clean. <laughs> <laughs> yes, Travis, they do. These Arizona women. Miracle Grow. Arizona women need Miracle Grow. <laughs> oh man! It's okay, no, nothing grows out of here. Like, I'm an anomaly. Potion. Yeah, see, clearly nothing grows after right, looking at my head. So we have to apparently stand next to each other. So here oh, comes no. the. No, you stay seated because it's going to be more of an. It's going to grow. It's, yeah. the, it's the same height. <laughs> this short? Oh, that's uh, that's questionable. Doopity do. I hate you all. All right, please rise. Oh, we love you so much. And it's the perfect armrest. <laughs> it? I'm gonna it? Damn. It? Damn. Oh. Megan, you have to have it in battle battle midget. Fuck no. off. No, it, it comes, guys, it comes with two shelves. Oh! <laughs> I'm back down. The shelves are still there, though. Hey. Right. They don't go away. And then you got Athena and David. Everyone, thank you so much for watching. Yeah, thank you. Thank you. Bye. Come here. It's okay. Bye. 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 You'll feel better. You'll feel better. I'm a